Hi and welcome to Quick Craft Tips. I'm Donna Salazar. Today I'm going to be sharing a peeled paint technique that I used on the background of this wall hanging. I start with my uh, chipboard page from my new denim art journal and I'm using fast finish decoupage to add just a couple little pieces of paper to the background and then I'm going to cover the entire page with the decoupage medium because I want it to have a similar finish all the way around and I'm also going over the string that ties the page to the stick because I want it to not come untied. I'm adding one more layer to uh, make sure that it's nice and even. And then I've done a whitewash with Liquitex paint, acrylic paint on the background, then added some white messy um, border. And now I'm going to use my pigment powders from Scrapbook Adhesives by 3L. I started with brown, and then I added blue, and these are the actual color names. Then I added pink, and then I added gold. And then I wanted the gold to show up a little bit more around the edge, so I added more of the fast finish decoupage around the edge, and then added the gold onto the wet decoupage. Now I'm adding some petroleum jelly around the edges. I want to put the petroleum jelly in a thin layer any place where I don't want the paint to stick. I'm also using some stencil masks from Hazel and Ruby, and I'm using my acrylic paint from Liquitex over the entire front of the wall hanging. I'm going to want to be really careful around those letters because when we pull them off we want them to be nice and clean and because we have that decoupage medium on the background it should make for really clean letters when we pull the stencil masks off. After the stencil masks are off that's when you can dry it with the heat gun. Then you're going to use the petroleum jelly around the edges one more time and we're going to use white acrylic paint this time right around the edges and then we are going to dry it again and then we'll use some um, baby wipes to remove the excess. So here is a video of me removing the paint to show that peeled paint texture. I'm using a uh, baby wipe and it's one of the baby wipes from Huggies. They're natural care and they smell good and they're good for your hands. They aren't going to dry out your paint or your hands. And I am pretty aggressive when I'm removing the paint. You can see by the camera shake here. But um, you just want to remove as much as you like or as little as you like to taste. And then um, this portion of the canvas will be done. Here's a close-up of some of the peeled paint texture on the background. And there are more photo steps of this canvas on my blog. And here are some other places where you can find me.